YouTube reactors are the problem of YouTube. Mm, I hate so. They will come out, say all sort of things about people's families, drag people, do saga, all because of the money. I hate so. They lie against people, put on thumbnails that are very deceptive just to get the crowd to come to their videos and watch. I also hate so. If you're a YouTube reactor who is always telling lies, stop it. And I'm going to, you know, tell you more about the YouTube reactors you have seen on the thumbnail of this picture. And the kind of YouTube reactors you should stay away from YouTube. Stay away from them on YouTube. Stay away from reactors that are vindictive. Stay away from reactors that are because going to reactors channel that are abusing people, calling out people, dragging people, who is going to stain your channel. But there are these reactors that I know that they don't call names and they are on this street. I'll be showing you those reactors so that you know the ones to stay away from. Well, maybe some that I don't know about may be good also, but as a small YouTuber, you need to be very careful how you go to reaction channels because it can make or break your channel. I've seen a lot of people who have been on reaction ch channels and shared their video and what it has cost them. But these people, I'm telling you, they react in a very cordial way. They like to either see the evidence or they want to just be very sure and they choose their words and one thing i know that they've always said on their comment section is no insult don't talk, insult anybody don't insult anybody's family and don't call out anybody when it's not necessary until th that thing they what you're accusing them of was done to you directly so when people come out to say youtube reactors are the problem youtube reactors are these i understand the the, from where the person is coming from because in every 12 there must be a judas there are some who would overdo it they call out people's families and say all manner of things about them but i'm going to show you the ones that are good for you to listen to let's keep watching this video to the very end while i bring up this but another thing i want to mention here is that as a YouTube, as a content creator, a small content creator, you need to be very careful the kind of channels you also share, apart from reactors. There are people who call themselves reactors, but they are not reactors. They are hate channels. Hate channels in the sense that what all they say from morning to night is abuses, calling out people's name, insulting people's husbands, you know, dragging people's children don't associate yourself with such you know channels if not you are going to be in you know your channel is going to it's going to be stagnant you know for this month we are praying and working on reaction uh, sorry working on youtube growth so if you want to really grow on youtube stay away from hate channels it will not help you stay away from hate channels it will not help you ensure that you create content that are going to help you if you are going to any channel let it be that they are talking about maybe a celebrity or a youtuber you like and you just went there to listen know what you comment because most of this because your helper may be on that live stream and you comment something that they don't like and your your career on YouTube had got uh, had come to its end, so you need to be very careful because I did that to cheap this so that as I'm teaching you how to grow on YouTube, how to make money on YouTube, how to start a YouTube channel, it is very good for me to also tell you the kind of YouTubers you should never ever ever go to. So now, one of the persons I know that does react reaction um, videos very well. In a cordial manner is the bunny goose and i remember one day bunny goose said she didn't want to talk about ogom series because she, ogom is dear to her and ogom supports people it's not like they talk about those they don't like but they talk about those they don't like but they talk about people they feel that their gist is out there because they too are here to make money they are here to talk about people's lives another person is choice tv 
church TV will never, you know, put you down. She just talk about your story and tells people not to abuse it. The same way with Bani, the Bani Ghost TV. She says, don't abuse people. Just state your point and don't insult anybody. Then another person is Vicky's corner. Vicky is another very wonderful reactor. She says the thing the way it is. And I was on a live stream where somebody was trying to drag another person. Vicky said she cannot say anything on that until she watches the video. I like that because she's learned and she knows that when you speak without being informed, you end up fooling yourself. So even when the person was putting it to Vicky that Vicky should admit, she said no, she cannot. And she's not holding brief for the person either until she watches the video. And that person is Vivian's TV. Vivian's TV is also a very, I like the way she talks when she's reacting. And there are people who are doing healthy reaction. And that person is Ella Suitable. Ella Suitable is also doing her reaction you know she talks about the people and she said no name calling and all that so these are very healthy reactors that i've seen on the street and they have done healthy reaction i've seen them have been on their live streams and i've watched their videos so i can tell if you look at and but one thing is even though you are on a healthy reaction reaction channel you need to see be careful the kind of comment you drop because the people who are not commenting on that channel on that live stream are more than the ones commenting and those who are not commenting are there to take comments to fly i'm not saying god cannot help you on white but you should be careful because nobody knows who your helper is you and now you might go to get collaboration and they'll turn you down so be careful like share and subscribe